Because what are they intended to solve? Traffic. Traffic. Right. Okay. So all you have to be is not in the same plane as where the traffic is. So you fly up above, and now you bypass all the traffic. Ah, so well, that's why Star Wars, when you look at the traffic on Star Wars, it's all these lanes of okay. flying cars right. on well, different levels. Once you add a dimension to it, right. then you're no longer limited to the boundaries of a two-dimensional surface. Right. Okay. So that's what the New York City subway is. It is motion in another dimension. It's not beholden to traffic on the surface. Right. So what we really need are more tunnels and bridges, not flying cars. That is a flying car. So <laughs> if you dig tunnels through everything, that's tantamount to a flying car. It's less noisy. But the physics will enable it in the end. It's just engineering at that point. 90 minutes. 45 minutes to LA. Oh, it's 45? Yes. Because it's a 90-minute round trip? Yes. Oh, man. 45 minutes to LA. You go there for lunch, come back. It takes oh. 45 minutes to go the length of Manhattan. It takes 45 minutes to get out of your driveway <laughs> in Los Angeles. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, where'd you go, man? I went to the mailbox. <laughs> I drove to the mailbox, like, at the end of my driveway. <laughs> Traffic was terrible. Terrible. So, oh, man. Yeah. I love it. The gravity train. I am happy. 